but it'll be ground up and it'll be in the style of the buildings that are there. The square is, like I said, like Norman Rockwell and 1880s construction. And so the building will fit in and we've got a National Register of Historic Places building on site that we're saving. It was an interurban railroad ticket booth. We're going to make it the valet ticket booth so that it can continues still to give out tickets, right? A hundred years on, it's still giving yeah. out tickets. I think that's cool. And so anyway, it's going to be 78 rooms. It's going to have a 200 and 225 probably person event center, rooftop bar, restaurant, uh, fine dining, Italian steakhouse restaurant, a variety of other amenities that, that are going to make it a really cool place to go, whether you're going to sleep there or not, which I thought was pretty yeah. important for our particular community. Yeah. It sounds like you're really making a destination and pride of ownership for all the locals as well. I think it'll be pride of ownership whether you own it or not. I think the big events in the town are going to happen there. I think when you go have a nice thing, you're going to have it. You're going to think of going there. When you've got somebody from out of town, and you want to show them what Medina is about. You're going to you're going to naturally go there. And as a result, it's a it's a great investment and a great math equation with a really personal bonus. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. And Medina being the county seat. That's right. 